frost on our tomato plants in our where we raise them here in the greenhouse and so it's time to clean out the plants and work the ground and get it ready to go again for next year for cucumbers in here maybe cherry tomatoes some too we still have some tomatoes which appear to be ripe but we don't have any ability to heat these out so when it frosts I kill the plants and you just gotta remove them and get ready for next year In the spring we had a video of the family putting sawdust down in the rows of the tomatoes in hopes that it would help keep the weed down and it worked pretty effectively. But now I've got to try to work it into the ground and then we're going to get some soil tests because I don't know how out of whack working all this sawdust into the ground will affect our fertility. And so we'll just have to see it. But it worked real well to keep the weeds down. At the end of this video, we'll put a link to our spring video showing the family putting the sawdust down. Well, I promise that I won't be gone too long. I'll be thinking about you every minute that I'm gone. Well, I promise that I won't be gone too long. I'll be thinking about you every minute that I'm gone. Well, I'm satisfied. When we planted and as the tomatoes grew, we tied them to the post to keep them from falling over. And so now I gotta cut the strings and pull the post and get the tomatoes out of the ground. And then I wanna burn them because there's too much risk of tomatoes carrying some kind of a blight. I don't wanna put them in the compost. Well, you're my baby, you're the one Throw your arms around me like a circle around the sun Well, you're my baby, you're the one Throw your arms around me like a circle around the sun Well, I'm satisfied, tickled too just to be with you These are cucumber vines which of course are, are frostbitten also and they still had cucumbers growing on them but of course they're done so gotta get them removed also and likewise I'd like to burn the cucumbers to try to stay away from any disease that their vines might have on them. <laughs> 